Hey there, imagine you're here. So today we're going to go over my recent Star Wars haul. A bunch of Funko Pop and I also have some Her Universe clothes that I got recently. So let's get started. So this is the Star Wars Gaming Vates box and we got this from GameStop. I don't know how much we got it for, but this is what it comes with. So it's Bastilla Shang and Jedi Knight Revan and they're GameStop exclusives. So this is from the video game, and here are the ones that you can get on the back. So it looks like she has a yellow lightsaber. I'll be honest, I have not played the video game, but now I'm kind of tempted to see what happens in this game, so. <laughs> this is Jedi Knight Revan, and he or she has a purple lightsaber. <laughs> and then same characters on the back. So I looked at the value of this one, and it's going for $25 on the Funko Pop app. Okay, and then Jedi Knight Revan is going for $31 on the Funko Pop app. So this is the keychain that it comes with. It's only worth $5 on the Funko Pop app. And then it also comes with an iron-on patch here. We also got this lanyard and it has that's the emblem on the bottom. You can put your card there. So you can use this side or the blue and white side. Okay, so the next pop I have for you guys is Wrecker from Bad Batch. And I recently just started watching the show on Disney Plus. Um, my husband's more into it than I am, but I still like Wrecker's character. And here are the ones you can get on the back. So I just really like his helmet. Lots of fun detail on it. Okay, so the next pop is Ahsoka Tano and she has dual white lightsabers. We got this for $14.99. On the app, it's actually going for $29. So I like your hood there. Yeah. This is an awesome one. It's an Amazon exclusive, so you can see why it's going for a lot. But here are the ones you can get on the back. I might get her lightsabers for my birthday next month, so we'll have to see. Okay, next pop I have is Luke Skywalker with Grogu. And this one is going for $13 on the Funko Pop app. But I actually got it from Amazon for $5.49, so this was a must buy. So it's not super rare, seems like a common one, but for $5 I could not pass on this. Okay, so the next pop I have is Boa Fett and Fennec on the throne. I really like this pop because it's super detailed and it's a very iconic kind of part of the show. So I only got this for $9 from Her Universe and right now it's going for $16 on the Funko Pop app. I also saw it recently at TJ Maxx for $10. So this, I feel like, is a really good pop, and I don't know why it's not worth more now, but I really love this one. Okay, so the next pop I have is Darth Maul and Gar Saxon. This is a Target Con exclusive. So Darth Maul is actually one of my husband's favorite characters, even though I'm really scared of him. And Gar Saxon is actually a character from Star Wars Rebel show. I haven't watched this show. So after some quick research, I found out that Gar Saxon is a Mandalorian who actually worked with Darth Maul in the Shadow Collective. So I'm gonna have to check this one out because these pops are really cool. Okay, so the next pops we have are actually a set. So it is Obi-Wan Kenobi and Darth Maul. And these are Amazon exclusives. They're from the Phantom Menace movie. Hmm, I wonder who the last one is. It's quite on gin. Let's be honest. <laughs> so the set is really cool because they actually connect and I can't wait to get the third one so that we can unbox them and find a nice place to display them. Look at that. So my husband got some socks from Stance and there was like a special Star Wars box. So there's the top there. So this box was actually $30.99. So there's a stand store in Disney Springs and they have a whole bunch of Disney 
Disney and socks and stuff like that. And there's also like sports stuff. So we got these Bad Batch socks. <laughs> so this is Tech and this is Wrecker. And then we also got another pair. This one was $13 and it's the Mandalorian. So now apparently we're collecting socks. <laughs> Next thing I have is this shirt from GameStop. And it's a Boba Fett. The shirt was 20 bucks. And yeah, I just like how it looks like comic-like. <laughs> also have some stuff from her universe. So we have this Jedi Knight. <laughs> I just like that it has this on the front. And so this is worth 80 and we got it on a huge sale. It was like 70% off. So I don't know how much it was. <laughs> $23. So I really like this shirt because it reminds me of like a mechanic shirt. <laughs> and the back is what's really cool. All right, so next I have this Ahsoka hoodie, sweatshirt hoodie, and this was actually only $13, normally $45. So the bottom says Tano. <laughs> so I really like this sweatshirt because I like the drawstrings and then the lettering on the bottom. Just like very modern and cool. So I'm going to wear this next time we go to Galaxy's Edge. So I didn't even notice there's a nice detail on the sleeve. And yeah. Okay, so the next shirt is actually a Christmas shirt that is a kid shirt. And it's actually R2D2, different R2D2s <laughs> in pixel form. And we actually got this for Lila, but I think it will fit me. <laughs> it was only six dollars. We just pretty much added it so we could get free shipping. Yeah, so Lila loves blue, that's why I got this shirt. I might end up wearing this this Christmas because it's still a little too big for her. Okay, so the last item is actually this shirt. It's a Fennec shirt and I really like this little pocket. It's actually nice and baggy. I don't really like tight shirts. So on the back it actually says Fennec. And um, the material is actually pretty thick, so probably wear this on one of the cooler days. But yeah, this shirt was only $10, so yeah, again, I love her universe clothes. We'll definitely buy more in the future. Okay, so that was my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed the stuff that I showed. And if you guys like Star Wars as much as we do, or more, please consider subscribing because we love going to Galaxy's Edge. We've recently been collecting like everything from there. We even have a video of us making droids and also we built a custom lightsaber at Savi's workshop and we also bought a lightsaber at Doc Ondar's. So yeah, if you like seeing that kind of stuff, please consider subscribing and please like the video because it does help me out. Thank you so much for watching and have a Disney filled day.